Hello everyone and welcome back to the Sport Horizon YouTube channel. In today's Tableau for Sport tutorial I'm going to go over how to make a dual axis chart. A dual axis chart is one of my personal favourites. It's really simple, it's really informative and above all it's very easy to make as well. Just before I begin the tutorial I'm just going to quickly show you what a dual axis chart actually looks like, what makes this chart unique and when it's most useful to actually use one of these. So, presented onto the screen right now is an example of a dual axis chart. You've got leagues, or in this case competition names, along the x-axis, and you've got progressive carries and carries into the penalty area alongside the y-axis. And this is what makes a dual axis chart unique, is its ability to present two different metrics upon the same graph. Uh, both metrics also having its own independent axes too. This is particularly useful if you want to identify trends or relationships between metrics and it's also useful if you just want to add that bit more extra detail into one of your graphs. So now I'm just going to quickly get into how, uh, get into how to make one of these. So you want to open a new worksheet here. You want to drag uh, your desired x-axis column to the columns. So in this case, we want competition name. You then want to add the two metrics into the row. So we want progressive carries and carries into the penalty area. And what Tableau does here automatically is that it creates two different, uh, two different graphs. But we want a single graph. So what we do is on the second metric that we inputted, we just hover over it and click on this little arrow. We go down to dual axis. And Tableau then creates a single axis, a single uh, graph, sorry. But we want to make this graph just a little bit better. As you can see, both, both axes showcase different values. We want them to showcase the same value. So what we can do is we can right click uh, on one of, one of the axes and we can click on synchronize axis. And what Tableau does is, is that it actually creates uh, creates different values but in but they actually make it the same so from here it goes 0 to 20 and for progressive carries it goes from 0 to 20 so to make this look better we want to go to entire view and we can also change how uh, each metric is presented so for progressive carries uh, I'll particularly want to make it a bar chart so what we can do is we can click on progressive carries in marks uh, we can just click on this drop down menu here and we can go to bar and I want to make carries into the penalty area a line chart so we can click on carries into the penalty area click on the drop down menu and go on to line and just like that you've created a dual axis chart in Tableau which presents progressive carries and carries into the penalty area across uh, the top five leagues in Europe. I really hope you found this tutorial useful. Please like and subscribe if you want to see future tutorials. And I hope to see you next time. Bye bye.